Hi everyone. In this tutorial, I'll, I'll show you how to enable Paystack Gateway on Cloud Poly. Cloud Poly is a text-to-speech SaaS platform which is available in Code Canyon. You can find the link in the description for the entire source code. Now, in this tutorial, um, I'll show how to create plan IDs for Paystack so that you can create uh, basically a subscription plans. Uh, that will allow your users to subscribe on a month for our monthly packages that you will create. Um, Cloud Poly supports uh, around eight or nine different payment gateways, and you can find them the list, entire list in, in Code Canyon. So let's go ahead and start the configuration of Paystack. Oh, by the way, if you are not familiar with Paystack, it's a payment gateway from mainly used in African continent. Um, if I remember correctly, it's from South Africa. And I'm not sure which currency support, but I think it's South African runs, uh, but we will check. So let's go ahead and log in as an admin. Now this is a dummy test account. So before we create subscription plans, make sure you, you enter your payment settings and um, for the um, Paystack. Um, so you'll need to enter your public key, um, Paystack public key, Paystack secret key, and set your webhook URI. So here, I, as you can see, I'm using basically a test credential. These are all test credentials, so they are not valid anyways. Um, so there's no need to hide them, at least for me. Um, so you can, as you can see, I entered my public key and secret key, and then on the web Paystack webhook URI, you'll need to enter your domain name and this link must exist on your Paystack account as well. Now, base URI doesn't change for Paystack. For example, in PayPal, they have Sandbox, sandbox um, URI and the Live URI, basically production URI. Uh, in Paystack, they, they refer mainly to the webhook URI and your keys. Your keys will, will define whether it's a text key or live key. Now, to get them, you'll go to your Paystack account under your profile settings. And you can see here is basically the keys. Um, now this is just random for testing your right was, but here you'll need to put your webhook URI basically. This one, just copy it here, supposed to go here. So this is ba this is implies the callback URI upon success. Um, that's it. And you don't forget to change this domain name to uh, your domain name where the script will be hosted. So the actual um, domain name where you'll install your script. And that's it. So next we can go and start our plans, subscription plans. But before this, let's go back to the Cloud Poly and actually create subscription plans. So under finance management, Go to subscription plans and create your first plan. So you can give a name for your uh, plan. Let's say it's um, um, I don't know entry. Now the price. Mm. So the currency in this case it's with um, Zars, which are South African rands. And if I don't, don't remember exact currency to US dollars, but let, let's just put 100, 200 just for testing purposes. And um, South African rands should be somewhere here. Yep. Now, currently, you can create payment um, plans on uh, subscription plans only for one month, uh, but with future updates, we will create um, on a yearly basis as well. It also has plan subscription. You can also create prepaid plans so people can buy prepaid packages uh, without any kind of um, uh, plan IDs, etc. That's basically they can buy credits on an ad hoc basis, the text to speech credits, which are basically characters. Now, here we'll be creating the Paystack plan ID. So that's where you'll put your plan IDs that you'll create um, on your Paystack account. Um, and you're basically selling text characters so with this package so for example for 200 uh, zars 
um, people can buy, let's say, 50,000 characters to convert these characters to uh, to synthesize convert um, synthesize these characters to a voice. Basically, you can add additional bonus characters if you want. That's up to you. And some provide some meaningful headings, such as marketing information, that will be visible on the prices that you will see um, on the front page and on the uh, subscription page as well. Uh, so just for the simplicity sake, let's just put option one, option two. Now all of them has to, has to be have to become comma separated. Now I will not click create yet because I'll need to include uh, paystack plan ID. So here, on your, let's go back to your paystack account. So that's your paystack account. Um, again, I'm in the test mode, so make sure that you're using your live production mode. So go to your plan. Uh, let's create a thing. I named time my package as an entry. You can put that whatever the, the description you want. This description is uh, mainly for you. Uh, I believe I put 200. Now interval is charged on a monthly basis. I don't want to. You don't want to send any kind of max number of payments. This is basically means after whatever the um, payment, it will just max out and the end user will not be charged. Uh, you don't want obviously to do that. Um, and that's it. Click create. So here we have created our uh, plan entry plan. Now this is the plan ID, plan code basically that, that you'll need. If you go back to Cloud Poly. Uh, I think I didn't copy it properly. So you pass paste it in the paste tag plan ID and don't forget about the currency. So here, since my currency is 200 dollars, you want to put this. You can create additional plans with different um, currencies and for different payment gateways if you want. Let's click create. Okay, now we have our plan. And there's one important thing to mention under finance management uh, and payment settings. When you'll be entering your Paystack information, make sure you actually enable uh, use Paystack subscription and use um, Paystack prepaid uh, if you have prepaid plans, of course. Uh, otherwise, um, and then click save here down below. Otherwise, people will not be able to see these payment gateways. Uh, that's it. Now let's go and subscribe to our the plan that we created. So this is the plan that we created. Um, and the reason why you see here dollars and not uh, the currency sign of the czars is because under global, in general settings, if you go to the invoice settings, if I remember correctly, Yeah, the currency here is not, oh, no, sorry, not here, apologies. It is under finance management, payment settings. So you can see the currency is not, you have to change the currency here so that it will be changed everywhere. Uh, let's actually go ahead and do this for the demo perspective. So we are looking at South African rands. Okay, and just click save. So now upon checkout, people will see the current uh, proper sign. So let's go ahead and make our first payment. Um, so the way Paystack works is basically you'll need to enter your email address um, of your Paystack account. And that's, let's go. No, as a buyer, I mean. And this is as since it's a, I have test API keys. Basically, it immediately gives you options. Um, so since it's went successful, assume you pay with your czars and pay successful. Now it will redirect back to the uh, page again, and it will see the initial five hundred fifty thousand credits that we added is included into the user account, including 20,000 dem demo credits as well. Um, now, if I go to my subscriptions, as you can see, I have a valid Paystack subscription now. Paid by Paystack, this is my subscription ID, 
and you can verify the subscription ID under your Paystack account if you go to uh, your plans that you created, which was entry. As you can see, we have one subscription. And it should be able to show us who is who. So this is the one sub K72H. Yep, K72H. So as you can see, we subscribe to this plan and on a monthly basis, uh, it basic end user will be charged and appropriate credits of this package uh, will be added. Now credits are defined on your plan basically. And don't forget you can always edit your plan on the subscription plan. So you can increase this value or decrease value as you need. And that's it. So as you can see it's very easy to set up Paystack uh, with this script. And on the next video we will show you how to configure um, Razor Pay. Uh, which is an uh, Indian payment gateway, uh, one of the popular ones. Thanks.